it is a very humbling experience to be the overall winner as it relates to being elected to be the next Hines County Sheriff. I look forward to this opportunity to move Hines County forward in a safe direction. I wouldn't be where I am today, first of all, without the good Lord watching over me along this journey. I'm very thankful for my family. I'm very thankful for my friends, the supporters, and those that voted in Salter Trust with the vision and platform that I shared during this campaign process to be able to lead Hines County forward as well. I'm thankful for those that voted for me and those that didn't vote for me as well. I look forward to working collectively with you all during this administration, continuing to make Hines County a safe place. As we know, the people want to feel safe. This is not in the city of Jackson. I plan to be a sheriff for all of Hines County. We have to address the issues that we're played with in the city of Jackson. We also have to address the issues in rural and unincorporated Hines County as well. And last but definitely not least, we have to address the issues that we're currently plagued with with the Hines County detention facilities and the consent decree that we're currently under as well. So these are the things that I look forward to addressing, bringing the right people in with the right knowledge and expertise along with my administration to move the Hines County Sheriff's Office in a very successful way as well. Your Sheriff, how do you, how do you account, how do you... What does it mean for you to serve as the Sheriff of Hines County? Well, it, it means a lot because this is something that I didn't just wake up and decide I wanted to do. I knew that I wanted to be the Hines County Sheriff. I knew that I wanted to follow in the footsteps of my friend, the late Sheriff Lee Vance, and be the next sheriff behind him. These are some of the things that we spoke about in the flesh when he was here with us. But of course, he's here with us in spirit. And he's watching over us. So it means a lot to me to be able to have the trust of the people. I have been grown. I have the knowledge and I have the expertise to move Hines County forward as well. So I'm thankful for those along my 22 year law enforcement career as well that have helped prepare me for this position that I'm taking on right now as well. Interim Sheriff, you had a come from behind upset victory over the, I'm sorry, I think I called you Interim Sheriff. You're the Sheriff Elect. You know, you're the Sheriff Elect. You had a come from behind upset victory over the Interim Sheriff. What do you account for that huge victory? Well, I believe that based on the November 2nd election, there was 69% of the citizens that voted in that election that wanted to see something different in the Sheriff's Office, okay? So, they just had 12 other candidates that those votes were spread, at, spread amongst. Well, obviously, there was the same case scenario with the runoff election. The citizens wanted to see something or someone different, a different administration moving the Hines County Sheriff's Office forward. So between the two candidates, they saw me, they trusted me more than my opponent, and they voted for me by the majority to move Hines County forward in a safe direction as well. So how does it feel for you to just have your family stand alongside you and your children witness this special moment? Well, it means a lot to me because my family has been there with me from the beginning. These are things that we prayed about, we discussed, we came to collective decisions about before I even decided to make this move. But not only that, my family endured with me. This was not an easy journey for me. They endured and they per persevered with me as well. You know, we, we were subject to different types of uh, oppositions. My family endured that. So they stood by me. So that means a lot to know that they stood by me through what I would consider the thick and the thin, and they're here with me to be able to celebrate what I would consider a momentous, moment, momentous, <laughs> monumental experience for me. So it means a lot to have them here with me. Uh, my mother is here, she's here, and she's able to enjoy this experience with me as well. Thank you, Sheriff-elect. Congratulations. Thank you all. Thank you all. All right.